After a splendid day in Malta, we now have a relaxing day at sea that will help us to recover from the journey out here. We have a leisurely breakfast with the usual view. And then another cup of coffee. Coffee time. The day at sea gives us an opportunity to explore the ship. And then we have a quiet time on the balcony. After which we have lunch. Well, we're back in the room and uh, about to unpack the suitcase. It's the day at sea. We've just had a meal and uh, taking it easy today. We're sailing east across the Mediterranean Sea to the island of Mykonos in Greece. I'm particularly excited as I was here with Rachel last month and we thoroughly enjoyed Mykonos. The day at sea on a cruise ship is always a special time. So as the sun sets, we can just relax, enjoy the beautiful ocean, and get ready for our shore excursion tomorrow. Next day, the usual breakfast and a second coffee then a big problem. Well, unfortunately, uh, Mykonos was cancelled because of high winds. Not much evidence of it, but the ship could not get into dock. So we are now another day at sea and passing the Greek islands over there. So we have another day at sea. Have a look at what's going on in the ship. There are many quiet places to relax, but I'm not enjoying this day. I had really hoped that Nathan would be able to see Mykonos. This morning in Mykonos, when we were told the venue had been cancelled, I was very disappointed, as there didn't appear to be much wind. When I inquired, I was told that the port of Mykonos was a difficult port to get into. C'est la vie. As we continue and sail east, we pass many small Greek islands. So I took a stroll around the ship and got a few shots of it. People relaxing, the weather excellent. So 
So I take a stroll around the ship while Nate relaxed on the balcony. <laughs> <laughs>